Well, the legend lives on, okay? We're talking Vernon's, the oldest bar in Corpus Christi. Oh, no, we can't call it a bar. It's more of a community gathering space. That's a good one, right? Right? <laughs> and uh, it's uh, not only celebrating its, what, 70th year? 71st. 71st year, but it's also getting ready for a big pachanga this weekend. Now, which one of you is Vernon? <laughs> He's over there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, there, there was a legendary yeah. Vernon, Vernon yeah. Klaus, right? Kraus. Kraus, yeah. Kraus. Kraus, who opened the place back in what, 48? 48. And then uh, there was a second family, and these are the third owners of Vernon, and we're talking Justin and Roy. Royce. Now, you have uh, set up a pachanga that happens every year. Tell us about it. Exactly. And how did this become uh, a thing? <laughs> <laughs> it started cool. as a. Uh, a gathering friends birthday just do some crawfish and have a birthday party and it's turned into now we're shutting down the street and bringing in thousands of pounds of crawfish and setting up tents and stage and bands so wow so are you shutting years. down the street in front oh shutting yeah. down yeah. buford oh yeah. my god yeah. and and so it's just a, is this a, a for your regular crowd or for the neighborhood or for who for, this is everybody yeah this is, it, yeah vernon's is an everybody started kind of place, a, so. for our regulars and then it's just become getting bigger every year and so, you know, the, thing, the only thing that concerns me, guys, is that eating something called a mud bug. I mean, I, I don't know that I should be doing that. Should we? Think of it as a mini lobster. I mean, oh, yeah. thousands of them. Yeah, you so. get a whole bunch of them. A whole bunch of them. <laughs> I'll take a pounds. dozen of those mini lobsters. Yeah. And uh, is it, how do you, does it cost to get in or just walk in? Everybody walks in unless you want to eat or drink. It doesn't cost anything. So. Uh -huh. yeah. Now, your your steak night's very popular. Yeah, well, that's, that's tonight. tonight. Oh, yeah, wow. Well, yeah. That's tonight. And, <laughs> and it's it's a rare opportunity where you can say, let's go hang out at the bar where Grandpa used to hang out because that's probably what happened. Yeah. Now, Vernon opened it after he came back from World War II, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it started as a grocery store that he worked at, and then he bought the grocery store and turned it into Vernon's in 48. 1948, amazing. Yeah. That is a, a legend to maintain. So the pachanga is really not just uh, crawdads, right? It's everything well, else. We, no. we got hamburgers, turkey legs, barbecue plates, brisket sausage. And a reunion yeah. of sorts for all your old friends, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. Anybody oh. that wants to come is welcome. So yeah. is this a, a WB Ray crowd or a King <laughs> crowd? Which uh, crowd is this? I would probably say it's more Ray, but there's both. There's yeah. both. I'm Carol, so we're, yeah. we're in the mix too. Oh, yeah. okay. Everybody. I'm going to be Kyle and Ray. I went to the close though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It'll be Carol guys cooking the crawfish. So. There you go. All right. Well, it's uh, coming up this weekend. Invite the folks. Go yeah. ahead, Justin. Come on down. Yeah, come on in. We start at 2 o'clock. Uh, crawfish will be served. Barbecue will be served. Music starts at 2 o'clock. Uh, you can always come in earlier. We're open from 7 a.m., so you can get there early if you want to. <laughs> And uh, there have been a few refinery workers that have hung out there over the years. A <laughs> couple. A couple hundred thousand, maybe. <laughs> so it's Saturday with the street closing and everything. So it's Burnin's, the legendary Burnin's Bar, now in its 71st year.